Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, delete that other one, Shalani. Okay, there's the new one right there. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Yes, Lord Jesus, we give you glory. Jesus. Hallelujah. Hey, everybody, we're just uh, going to give everybody about uh, about 30 seconds to a minute to just uh, for people to log on. We thank you all for uh, joining us tonight for this time of prayer and intercession for our nation, uh, for our churches, our families. If you can do us a quick favor and if you can share this post uh, on your Facebook pages, we want to get as many people involved in this prayer as we possibly can. Uh, if you have families, gather your families uh, around uh, in a room and join this live feed and grab your families and pray with us because I believe that God wants to minister to households, not just us as individuals, but he wants to minister to our whole household and he wants to touch us. And so share this feed, um, gather your family together, uh, get a nice comfortable spot. And please, as we are praying, we ask that you would interact and pray with us on things that we are praying for. Uh, God speaks to you and speaks to speak something to your mind. Uh, we ask that you pray for pray it out. Um, pray for a person that that you may know that is backslidden. Pray for some your neighbors. Pray for uh, somebody who needs healing. Somebody who needs deliverance. Uh, we're going to be covering quite a bit of things tonight. But we want you to be involved in praying with us, all right? We don't want you just to watch us pray, but we want you to pray with us. Uh, I've got a few people here in the room with me right now, some people from, some, uh, some saints from the church, as well as my wife and family are here with me praying. And so we are going to lift our voices together along with these other pastors. Uh, we have Pastor Rima Duncan from Chicago, Illinois, uh, that is with us, and we have Brother... Jim McKinnis from South Bend, Indiana, that is on the prayer line with us right now. And we have Pastor Ed Ford from Hartford, Connecticut, that will be praying and help facilitating this prayer. We appreciate you all for joining in. And so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to wait about 20 to 30 more seconds. Um, if you need to get some water, then get you some water. Um, if you need to do whatever you got to do, just... Uh, take these next couple of these next 30 seconds to uh, go and do what you got to do. That way you won't have to be uh, interrupted for anything during this time of prayer, because we really want you to be involved in this prayer meeting that we are having tonight. Amen. Um, is there anything that any of the other pastors that are on you want to, would you like to say anything that you're feeling right now? Okay. All right. So once again, I want to thank you all for coming on. Um, we were wanting to do a prayer revival. Um, actually, we had prepared to have a prayer revival here in the state of Indiana for our whole state, uh, praying for our cities and in, in the Indiana district, uh, praying for revival, praying for backsliders, praying for the sick, praying for God to really do something miraculous in our churches and in our state. And so because of the pandemic uh, that is taking place with the virus uh, that is spreading very rapidly in our country, we were not able to meet physically together. But what an opportunity this is to be able to not just pray uh, in one specific place, but to join together from people from all around the country and even the world. Maybe there's somebody from another country that may be joining in to this feed, but this is a perfect opportunity for the world, us, the saints of the living God and people that have a desire to see God's will done in the earth, to join yes. together and to lift our voices and cry mm -hmm. out to God for revival, to cry out to God 
for our families to cry out to God for, for in this time of need, for provision, for all the things that, that, are, that is going on in our world. Um, there's so much devastation that is happening. Uh, people are losing their jobs. People are, are I, I just got a phone call earlier today where uh, an individual was saying that, uh, that a person, their apartment complex was not willing to work with them because they lost their job and they had no finances to be able to afford the place that they live. And their apartment complex had decided that they are going to put them out if they don't come up with the money. And so you know, we're just going to believe God and do what we can to help them. And so I know that there are people that are on this prayer line right now or on this mm -hmm. live that have a lot of needs. And so right now we ask that you do not spectate. Just don't get on here to spectate and to watch us pray. But we want you to join us and lift your voice and call out to God with us. All right. Yes. And so if you have if you have any prayer request, anything that you would like for us to pray for specifically after each of the pastors that are on will our pray after we pray our specific focus points of prayer. My wife is moderating the comments and she will be bringing uh, prayer needs to our attention that we are to pray for. And we want to call out your name, call out whatever your need is in prayer together. And this is a beautiful opportunity for the whole country and world to be able to come together and join in prayer for your specific need. You know, that's the amazing thing about technology that you don't have to be in the same place, but you can all join into one link and to be able to pray and lift your voices together. And so this is an awesome opportunity. And I want to thank you all for joining in once again. Once again, I want to thank all the pastors that are on this Zoom call that are that have joined with me to pray uh, for the specific needs that will be brought to our attention and the focus points of prayer that I have given to each of them for them to pray for. So right now at this time, what I want us to do is I want us to lift our voices and I want us to begin to praise and worship God. I believe that if we praise and worship God and we call it to call out his name and, and declare to him that he is the savior of the universe, he is the creator of the heavens and the earth, that he is the one that was, which is and is to come, that he is the alpha and the omega, the beginning and the end. If we begin to call Jesus as he is and we begin to speak his name, I believe that God oh, will come to each and every one of our rooms, wherever we may be sitting. You may be sitting in your bed room you may be in your living room right now you may be in the doors you may be in the sanctuary you wherever you may be maybe you're driving in your car right now but i believe that if we speak the name of jesus and we begin to praise his most holy name that god will begin yes. to come in and god oh, will begin god. To touch us and he will begin to invade our space and we'll be mm. able to feel the presence of the yes, lord yes god, god yes god upon us and we'll begin to feel burdens and God will bring things to things to our minds that will that will, that he wants us to call out in prayer. I believe that this is a time that the Lord wants to use us in the yes. spirit to be able to pray and to call out the things that he desires for us to call out. I believe that God wants to speak some things to us tonight. Yeah. And so what I want us to do is just to lift our voices and I want us to begin to call on the name of the Lord right now. Come on, lift your voice. Yes, God, I pray Lord. ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、
God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way, God. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, God. We speak it, God. We speak it, God. We proclaim it, God. God, we stand upon it, God. Have your way, Jesus. Have your way. Touch people in their living rooms. Touch people in their homes, God. God, touch them, God. Saturate them today with your spirit. You're not confined, God. You are with them right now, God. You are everywhere, God. You are right here with them. I pray in the name of Jesus. Anoint it, God. God, anoint it, God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. Jesus, in the name of Jesus, yeah, we stand upon your word. Hallelujah. We exalt your name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Submit, God, to you, God. We obey, God. You're leading in the prompting of the Holy Ghost, God. Let it be tonight, God. Let it be anointed. Bless it, God. Touch it, God. Touch lives. Touch hearts, God. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. You are mighty. You are holy, God. You are everything, Jesus. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. God, God. To those needs, God. The hungry heart, God, that desires to hear hope, God. Desires to hear your word, God. Desires, God. Something more, God, for them. I had a local soca. In Jesus' name, pour your spirit out. Pour your spirit out. Pour your spirit out. Pour your spirit. Yes, God. In the name of Jesus. 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 In the name of God, anoint the churches, God, anoint the families, God, anoint the fathers, God, anoint the mothers, God, anoint the children, God. God, we pray, God, that you would anoint and touch and bless, God. Operate, God. Let your spirit operate, God. Let us come to a spiritual dimension, God. Hallelujah. Let us rise up into the spirit realm. Let us speak, God. Let us speak it, God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. Touch it, God. Anoint it, God. Bless it, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Loose those. We speak liberty, God. We speak freedom, God. Speak it, God, right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, God. We cry out for you, Lord. We need you. We need you, Lord. We need you, God. We need you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. Touch it, Lord. Touch it, God. Yes, 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 God. Touch it, God. Anoint it, God. Bless it, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Work, God. Operate, Jesus. Operate, God. Operate in living rooms, God. Operate, God. Through the devices, God. I pray in the name of Jesus that they would bring your spirit, God. Flow. God, let it flow, God. God, let it flow, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, you are mighty. You are holy. Hallelujah. You are awesome, God. You are awesome, God. 
You are awesome, God. You are awesome, God. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 God. Work, God. In the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. Touch it, God. Touch it, Jesus. Touch it, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. In the name, in the name, in the name, in the name. Have it, God. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way. Operate, Jesus. Operate, Jesus. Operate, Jesus. Flow, God. Flow, God. Flow, God. Hallelujah. You are the King of Kings, God. You are the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are the Prince of Peace, God. I pray in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, God. We speak peace, God, and hope, God. I pray in Jesus. Thank you, Have your way. We thank you, God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 We submit to you, God. You are the God of the harvest. You are the God of the harvest, God. Hallelujah. You are coming to church, God. How you're mobilizing the church to the harvest. This God, I pray in the name of Jesus, you would anoint our hands, anoint our lips, God, anoint our minds, God. I pray, God, that you would give us, God, words to speak, God. God, that you would give us, God, understanding of the times that we live upon, God, that understanding, God, of the times, God, understanding of the harvest and the great need, the great opportunity, God. God, there's so much uncertainty, God, but you've given the church, God, for the world. You've given the church, God, to be a beacon of light. You've given a church, God, to cry hope, God. God, ya raboko soto raboka, ya rarakasa. Ya raboko soto raboko, ya tamakahi. I pray in the name of Jesus that you would pour your spirit out, God, in families, in children, God, in homes, God, uh, all around us, God. I pray, God, for city revivals. I pray for city revivals, community revivals that would break out beyond the walls of the church, God. The revival, the harvest is so much vaster and greater, God, than our minds can comprehend, God. God, there will be no God, man's fingerprints, God, on your harvest, God. God, let's pick up the sickle, God. In the name of Jesus, we need you, God. God, give us discernment, God. God, give us understanding of the time that we live in. Give us understanding, God, of what you've called us to do, God. Hallelujah, God. There is a great harvest among us, God. There's a great need out there crying for hope, God. We speak hope, God. We speak life, God. We speak Speak faith, God, in the name of Jesus. We give you, God, all the glory, God. It is your harvest. It's not our harvest, God. It is your harvest. It's not ours, God. It's our hands and your harvest, God. I pray that you would anoint the hands, anoint the workers out there, God. Mobilize those, God, that once, God, God had a desire to pray. Mobilize those prayer warriors. Mobilize, God, those interceders, God. Those that the prayer of intercession would come forth for the city. The prayer of intercession will come forth for communities. Prayer of intercession will come forth, God. I pray in the name of Jesus for our leaders, God. I pray that you would touch them and anoint them, God. The harvest is vast, God. The harvest is great, God. I pray, Lord, that you would mobilize us and call us, God. I pray to the hurting, God. I pray, God, those that are despondent and lost, God. I pray, God, that you would touch them, God. By God, I pray, Lord, that the church, God, would rise up, God, and proclaim hope, proclaim peace, God, proclaim joy, God. 
The latter rain is coming, God. And I pray, Lord, that we would receive it, God. God, we are unworthy, God, and we are broken vessels before you, God. I pray that you, God, would work through these broken vessels in this harvest time. I pray, God, that you would look at us, God, and just look at hungry hearts, God, that are willing. We are willing and obedient, God, submissive to your word, God, and your will. I pray that we would tie into your purpose, God. We would tie in, God, to your purpose, God, of the harvest, God. I pray, Lord, that you would anoint us and touch us and bless us, God. I pray you will go before us, God. I pray that you equip us with opportunities, God, and knowledge, God, of the way that we're supposed to reach, God, the way that we're supposed to connect, God. I pray, God, that what the enemy used to defeat us, God, is going to be used for the harvest. What the enemy used, God, to distract us is going to be used, God, for the harvest. I speak it, God, over families. I speak it over pastors. I speak it over ministers. There are people that are listening to this right now in the name of Jesus, that God is calling you to preach the gospel. God is calling you to be a laborer in the harvest. There's some of you, God, that has put that gift on a, on a shelf. And I speak right now in the name of Jesus that you would pull it back out. God still has that calling on your life. God still has that, that desire in your heart, God, to teach Bible studies, to reach God, to pray God. I pray in the name of Jesus, you would mobilize, you would equip God, God, that we would submit unto you, God. You are the Lord of the harvest, God, and we submit to you, God. You're looking to and fro, just trying to find somebody to show yourself mighty God. Workers are needed. I pray that you would look at hearts. God, it's not about God. It's not about a church building. It's about a harvest that's bigger than what our minds can comprehend. God, this latter day revival, God, that you have us part of, unprecedented revival is upon us, God. If we would seek your face, God, humble ourselves, God, I'd pour you would pour your spirit out, God. We submit it unto you, God. We need you, God. We need you to direct churches. We need you to direct our leadership. God, I pray, God, right now that pastors would rise up, come together, God, and begin to speak revival, speak hope to communities, speak hope to city leaders, speak hope to our nation's leaders. I speak it right now, God, that you would anoint it and bless it, God. I pray for our children, God, that your spirit, God, in this latter day harvest, God, you'll use our children to prophesy. You'll use our children to speak words. you use our children, God, to do a great work, God. I pray in the name of Jesus, God, you're no respecter of persons, God. I pray that you're going to call out. Revival is going to start in the streets. It's going to roll all over in our businesses. It's going to roll into schools. It's going to roll all over the place. I pray right now, God, you're the God of the harvest, God. We submit to you, God. We proclaim your word, God. We need you, God. God, we need you, Jesus. We need you, God. Hallelujah. I pray, God, that you would speak, God, a mobilization order in the lives, God. Mobilization order, God, in the families, God. God, that we are mobilizing, God. You're mobilizing and calling a church to the harvest, God. I pray that churches would prepare for the harvest, God. I pray that families would prepare for the harvest, Lord. God, you are the Lord of the harvest, God. God, it is not our works, God, that's going to do it. It's your ability, God. It's not going to come by our intellect. It's not going to come by our planning. It's not going to come by, by our own means, God. It's not going to come through just this human way, God. It's going to come through you, God. This Latter-day revival is going to come through submissiveness, God, to your word in your your will, God, and I speak it right now in the name of Jesus, that you would mobilize into the harvest right now. I pray, God, that as people are hear this, that faith rises in their hearts, faith rises in their lives, God. I pray that many people will be called, God, called to share love, called, God, as the world looks for an antidote, God, for a virus. You are the antidote, God, that everybody needs, God. It is Jesus. It is Jesus, God, and you're calling us to the harvest, God. We thank you, God. We submit to you, God. God, you are everything, God. Let us not walk in the natural realm, God. Let us walk in the spiritual realm. Let us lift up, God, and see the victory that's before for us, God. Through all the calamity, God, there's a harvest. Through all the issues, there's a harvest. Through all the, the 
problems and everything that the world is saying, we see something greater. We see a harvest. God, we are casting our eyes on the victory. We're casting our eyes and you're pushing the church to the purpose, God. And this latter day revival, God, you're going to anoint and equip, God. You're going to provide, God. You're going to take no name people, God, and be able to use them, God, in a mighty way. I pray in the name of Jesus that you would anoint it and bless it, God. God, we ask you right now, God, that you would equip it and touch it, God. I pray for every person that's listening right now, God, that they would be mobilized into the harvest, God, in the name of Jesus. I pray, God, that each and every person will begin to pray in the spirit. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. We thank you, God. We worship you, God. We give you glory, God. We give you glory, God. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, hallelujah. Worship with us, worship with us, hallelujah. Lord Jesus, we worship you. We give your name the praise, Lord God. Yes. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the opportunity to be in this hour for such a time as this, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for the opportunity mm. to be the church, Lord Jesus. Lord God, you've anointed us for this hour. Jesus. You've equipped us for this hour. Yes. You've prepared us for this hour, Lord Jesus. You are structuring us for this hour, Lord Jesus. Today, Lord, we pray, Lord Jesus, for spiritual leadership, Lord. Lord all across, Lord Jesus. We believe, Lord God, this world, Lord God, that you have equipped the church, Lord Jesus, to be in one mind, in one accord, Lord Jesus, to touch your throne and to hear your voice. Lord God, you are devising a plan, Lord Jesus, that Satan cannot stop. You are devising a plan, Lord Jesus, that this world could not see, Lord God. You are devising a plan, Lord God, that Satan, Lord Jesus, has no awareness of, Lord. Lord Jesus, you are giving authority, Lord Jesus, in power, Lord God, yes. to your people to build your church. Lord, your church is not a building, but your church is people. Your church is people who are poor, filled with your spirit and called out by your name today. Lord, I pray, Lord, for a mighty anointing, mm -hmm. Lord God. Oh, Lord Jesus, upon our leadership, mm -hmm. Lord Jesus, to walk in faith mm -hmm. and not by sight, to trust your voice. And Lord, not what we see, Lord Jesus, you're leading us into places that we've never been before. Lord Jesus, we need a dependency upon yes. you like we've never had before. Mm -hmm. In the name of Jesus, we ask you today, Lord God, I loose a unity of the faith upon leaders. Lord God, on national levels. Lord Jesus, on state levels, in local levels, Lord Jesus. We ask you, Lord Jesus, Lord, amongst the apostolic movement and beyond, Lord. Lord God, we declare, Lord Jesus, that you're going to loose a revelation of truth, Lord Jesus. Lord, as there's a falling away, there's also going to be a coming in, Lord. Lord, I pray that you would put divine strategies in people's minds, yes, divine yes, yes, ideas, yes. Lord God, that Lord, things that are above and beyond all that we can ask or think. Lord Jesus, you're going to put it in us, Lord God, at every single level. Lord, you're going to anoint us to mobilize people in every place, Lord, rank and file in your army, Lord Jesus. Lord God, uh, this is a nameless revival. The only name, Lord God, is your name, Lord Jesus. This is a faceless revival, Lord. Yes. It's not about any one man or any one woman, Lord Jesus. It's not about any one organization, Lord, but it's about your kingdom. It's about your kingdom being advanced, Lord Jesus, in the hearts of humanity, Lord. I declare it, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, that, Lord, there would be a spirit, the gift of faith would be loosed, Lord God. Lord God, from the top down, Lord, in the name of Jesus, that we would operate in faith. I lose the gifts of the Spirit, Lord Jesus. Yeah. I lose the fruit of the Spirit, Lord, that there would be liberty, divine order, Lord God. I lose the fear of the Lord, Lord Jesus. For Lord, wherever the fear of the Lord is, mm -hmm. there is strong confidence. You want us to be confident. Every saint, every pastor, Lord God, every district superintendent, every bishop, Lord, every general superintendent and board, Lord God, you want us to be confident in your voice, 
like we have never been before. Lord, you want us to unite like we have never been before. Oh, Lord Jesus, you're going to show the world today that we truly are your disciples in that we have love one for another. I lose apostolic giving. I lose apostolic prayer. I lose apostolic fervor and passion and holy boldness yeah. in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Mm. I lose submission, Lord, one to another, Lord Jesus. Lord God, mm -hmm. I bind the spirit of offense, Lord, that would try to get in the way of revival, Lord Jesus. I bind the spirit, Lord Jesus, Lord God, of mistrust, Lord, in the name of Jesus, that would try to cause a wedge and would try to distort, Lord God, your holy purpose that you want to accomplish in your body in this hour. Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, that there be a great calling that goes out, Lord God, far and wide, from every corner of the earth, you're calling men and women, you're calling boys and girls, you're calling young people to answer the call of God, every man and woman a missionary, every saint a missionary, Lord Jesus, every preacher a missionary, every pastor, every Lord God department, Lord head, Lord, as a missionary, you're calling us to evangelize, you're calling us to make disciples, Lord, you're calling us to teach Bible studies, Jesus. I pray, and I loose an anointing to teach, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I pray that you would put us in places of influence, put yes. us in places of favor, Lord, let us not fear their faces, but let us teach, Lord God, and preach the truth in love, let us preach the gospel, Lord, to every creature, you're going to put us in high places, in low places, you're going to put, Lord, us in places, Lord Jesus, Lord God, where you're softening the hearts of people, Lord God, people of wealth, people of influence, movers and shakers, Lord, you're going to put people, Lord, in your body, Lord God, with a voice, with a word in their ear, Lord Jesus, is going to cause many to repent. <laughs> Lord, I declare it, Lord Jesus, oh, like the king of Nineveh, Lord, Lord, I believe there's going to be government leaders across this nation who are going to call days of prayer and fasting, Lord, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Jesus Christ. Uh, oh God, there's going to be, Lord God, school superintendents. Uh, we're going to call public schools to prayer and fasting. Uh, Lord, I declare it in the name of Jesus, Lord. Uh, Lord, you're going to turn the hearts of kings. Uh, you're going to turn the hearts of governors. Uh, you're going to turn the hearts, Lord God, uh, Lord Jesus of mayors today. You're going to turn the hearts of people, CEOs of major corporations, Lord. Uh, Lord, it is your will, Lord Jesus, uh, for this word to get out and to transform lives. Oh, Lord, Lord, you have already laid the wealth of the wicked uh, for the righteous, uh, for the purpose of your kingdom. It's not for us to build bigger barns, Lord Jesus, uh, but Lord, it's for us to advance your kingdom. Yes. It's for us, Lord God, to advance your kingdom, Lord. We declare it in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, Lord Jesus, I pray uh, that, Lord, we would prepare our hearts, uh, that we would prepare mm -hmm. our voices, Lord God. Uh, for, Lord God, you don't want us, Lord Jesus, uh, to go in with an agenda, to go in with a plan. But as we pray, you're going to speak to us. You're going to order our steps. You're going to give us a God-ordained strategy that's not going to make sense to the flesh. And when you put us, Lord God, in the places that we need to go, as we open our mouths, you are going to fill it with thus saith the Lord. I declare it today. I thank you for the unity. I thank you for the harvest, Lord Jesus. Mm. Lord God, draw us to deeper intimacy mm -hmm. with you, Lord, that Lord children would be brought forth into your kingdom, Lord. It's going to come from the east, the west, the north, and the south. We declare it. We give you thanks for it. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Yes, Hallelujah, God. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Let's take some time just to pray in the spirit right now in the name of Jesus. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> 
Lori Carita Leta Yote. El Corrieta Castle in all this life. I pray in the name of Jesus Jesus. that you would dispatch angels ministering lord god and receiving the words of their yes, prayers God, right God. now in the name of jesus hallelujah mm-hmm. quicken us lord god that are filled with your spirit jesus. and those that may be born God, here, God. That are not filled with your spirit the most powerful and greatest miracle of all which is the infilling of your holy ghost let it begin to fall in the rooms where they are right now mm. if they're listening in their vehicles lord let it fall lord god if they're a jesus. worker that is having to be on site right now, Lord God, and they're listening or tuning in. Let the atmosphere of their employment, Lord God, begin to be filled, Lord yes, Jesus. Yes, 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 yes. Supernatural endowment, Lord God, of your spirit that begins to reach through every crevice of that atmosphere, Lord, in place. In the name of Jesus, we seek you right now, Lord God. We understand, Lord God, that there is a thing that can hinder the moving of your spirit and the manifestation of of your power, and that is the pride uh, and the unrepented heart, Lord. Jesus. So, Lord, uh, we oh, repent God. before you, Lord God. Uh, we repent of the sins <laughs> of our <laughs> thoughts, uh, We repent of the sins of our deeds. Uh, we Jesus. repent of the sins of our words. Uh, we repent of the sins of omission, Lord God. Uh, we repent, Lord God. Hallelujah. And, Lord Jesus, as we ask you uh, for forgiveness, mm. as you shine your spotlight uh, on our hearts and minds, Lord, uh, we also extend forgiveness uh, to all all those that have done wrong against us, Lord Jesus, uh, we repent before you, Lord God, uh, mm-hmm. fully and completely, Lord God, uh, everyone that has hurt us, uh, everyone that has set all against us, uh, everyone that has used us, uh, everyone that has disappointed us, uh, everyone that has frustrated us, Lord God, we release them mm-hmm. right now in the mighty name of Jesus from our grudges uh, and our unforgiveness uh, and our bitterness, Lord God, and uh, let us begin to step uh, into the light of your glory, Lord Jesus, uh, as you are prepared preparing the future for your body, Lord God, even today, Lord God. uh, Use, Lord Jesus, the current pressure, Lord Jesus, uh, to push us, Lord God, into glory. Lord God, I pray in the name of Jesus uh, that you continue to activate the gifts of your spirit, Lord God, uh, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Let them be flowing like more now than ever before, Lord Jesus. I pray in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, mm-hmm. that you cover us, Lord God, our families, uh, our churches, our saints, our brothers, our sisters, uh, mm-hmm. our co-workers, Lord, our neighbors, Lord God. Uh, cover them under your blood, Lord Jesus. Uh, cover their mm-hmm. hearts, uh, cover their minds, uh, cover their emotions, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, 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 as we step into a realm uh, of intercession right now, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord. Uh, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah. That you cover their hearts and minds uh, under your blood, Lord Jesus. Uh, and we pray, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, uh, hallelujah, that you equip us, Lord God, and protect us uh, as we're traveling through this season uh, that you've allowed in our world, Lord God, uh, yes. not just in our nation, but in our world. We're traveling through it, Lord God, uh, and we're all trying to cope, Lord Jesus. Uh, we're all trying to navigate, Lord God. Uh, but I pray in the name of Jesus that as we walk through, uh, that you would equip us with the armor of God. Hallelujah. We put on the breastplate of righteousness. Uh, we equip ourselves with our loins girt about with truth and our feet shod uh, with the preparation of the gospel of peace, Lord, uh, the helmet of salvation, the shield of faith, uh, the sword of the spirit, which is your word. Uh, Lord God, let the fruit of your spirit begin to show more now than ever before. Love, joy, peace, uh, long suffering, Lord, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, uh, temperance in the name of Jesus. Uh, Lord God, let the gifts of your spirit, Lord God, uh, begin to be evident yes, more now than ever before, Lord, a word of wisdom, a word of knowledge, discerning uh, of spirits, Lord Jesus, uh, tongues and interpretation thereof, uh, prophecy, Lord God, working of miracles, uh, hallelujah, gift of faith and gift of healing, uh, and also let us begin to wield the weapons uh, of our warfare, the word of God, uh, the word of our testimony, hallelujah, mm-hmm. the blood of the lamb, the name of Jesus. 
Jesus. Uh, hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Prayer praises the hallelujah. Your angels that fight for us, Lord God, yes, in the uh, gift yes, of the God. Holy Ghost. Uh, hallelujah. I pray in the name of mm -hmm. Jesus uh, that you equip us, Lord God. Hallelujah. To impact everyone that we are connected to, Lord. Quicken our minds, uh, quicken our hearts, Lord God. Uh, and just like mm -hmm. you did for your apostles uh, in the book of Acts, Lord God, uh, let special and unusual miracles begin to be loosed among yes, our angst, Lord yes, God. Yes. In the name of Jesus, uh, unexplainable, Lord God, irrefutable miracles, yes, Lord yes, God, yes. that begin to show up, Lord God, in our ranks, Lord God, uh, and walk through our words and in our hands, Lord Jesus. Uh, hallelujah. Let it begin to happen even now, Lord God, uh, as we draw nigh unto you in this season, Lord God. I pray. We curse every disease, hallelujah. We command healing, Lord command blessing, Lord Jesus, as your body comes together in prayer and in unity, Lord. Lord, we loose the yeah, angels we'll of the Lord. Uh, hallelujah to show themselves strong uh, in mm. the lives and minds of people, Lord God. Uh, let them begin to manifest in our reality. Let them begin to manifest in our dreams. Mm. Let them begin to manifest, Lord God. Hallelujah. In our lives more now than ever before. Let the yes, church God. begin yes, to step uh, into the realm of the prophetic uh, mm. that you ordained for the year of the Lord, 2020, Lord God. Uh, it was a year that you ordained for the seers to see uh, for the reviving of the body and the eyes begin to open and awaken hallelujah in the name of yes, Jesus, God. let the seers arise among us Lord God uh, that will walk mm. in the spirit without fear hallelujah hallelujah that would be confident uh, in the walking of the spirit Lord Jesus uh, and the working of your power Lord God uh, we will not hold your hand back any longer we will not suppress the, your spirit any longer hallelujah we will not box you in our programs any longer. Hallelujah. We will not box you in our traditions any longer. We will not limit your hand with our religions any longer. Hallelujah. We loose you. Hallelujah. And we loose our faith to believe for things that we've never seen before. To believe for things, Lord God, that we've never walked in before. Hallelujah. Dimensions of your spirit you're going to loose. Hallelujah. Even to people that we might think don't deserve it, Lord. Lord God, I'm speaking to them uh, that are listening right now, backsliders, Lord God. Uh, I'm speaking to them right now, hallelujah, people that think they're inadequate. Uh, I'm speaking to them right now uh, that special miracles are coming your way. Uh, special and unique, unusual miracles uh, are beginning to manifest even now, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, someone's body is beginning to be healed even now. Uh, and not just the recovery of healing, uh, but instantaneous, uh, miraculous healing, Lord God, of things that doctors cannot heal or treat in yes. the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Things that have been diagnosed and prognosis have gone forth over people's lives that they've decided and relegated their lives to live and cope with things they thought would never go away. Even now, as we pray, Lord God, you are sending healing angels to minister, Lord God, and mm. special, impossible, unusual, and unique miracles are beginning to manifest throughout our nation, hallelujah, in the United States, in Canada, in Mexico, Lord God, every other nation, Lord God, might be tuning in right now, in the name of Jesus, Jesus. we loose it right now with our words, hallelujah, we loose those angels, Lord, we take our hands off of our congregations, we take our hands off off of our loved ones that we desire to see saved, and we loose you, Lord God, to do I what only you can do, Lord yes. God, in the name of the Lord, Yar, he called the Kostotor Kokaya, Eranala Yori, Himbokoya, Yasokaria, Takari, Kostotor Kokaya. 
Idore bare pore ma indore he kayo sore a yore atabashare ha ya ya ye lo we storm your throne right now Jesus. in the name of Jesus in supplication <laughs> Lord God reminding you of your word that you told us Lord God that when you when we come Lord God even if you shut up the heavens for rain Lord God even if you cause famine or drought or slumped economy Lord God that Lord God if we turn to you you said even if locusts will come upon lands Lord God hallelujah even if you send the pestilence if they come from you, hallelujah, not from our enemy, not from our adversary, not from the devil, but if you yourself would send it, you said if your people who are called by your name, hallelujah, will humble themselves and pray and seek your face and turn from their wicked ways, you will hear, you will forgive, and you will heal, Lord God. And so we remind you of your word right now, Lord yes. God. Yes. We ask you, Lord Jesus, to hold up your end of the bargain, Lord God. Mm. Heal, deliver, Lord. Set free, Lord God. Hallelujah. Yes, Mend yes. the broken. Set at liberty those that are bruised. Oh God, open blinded eyes. Unstop deaf ears. Not in China. Not just in India. Not just in Africa. Not just in Asia. Hallelujah. But here in the United States of America and Canada, Lord God. Hasta in the name of Jesus. Special yes, miracles God. to be loosed right now. Now in our midst, in the name of the Most High God, Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Mm. Come on, let's just worship him right now. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Committees of angels are going forth right now. Committees of angels are going forth right now. Mm -hmm. Visiting homes. Hallelujah. Visiting Hallelujah. broken marriages. Yes, yes. yes. Visiting backsliding uh, and lost family yeah, members. Yeah, yeah. Committees of angels, hallelujah, are going to begin to do what we cannot do on our own in the name of Jesus. Uh, we speak ah, yeah, 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 yeah. into the airways, into the world wide web, hallelujah. That the spirit of the Lord will begin to send us an infinite amount of angels, uh, innumerable, uh, are being loosed into homes. Uh, hallelujah. Jesus. Cancer is being reversed. Hallelujah. Yes, God, yes, Diabetes God. and sugar in the blood has been regulated. Yes, blood Jesus. pressure, hallelujah, is being God, brought yeah. under control. Uh, mm. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. Instantaneous miracles. Instantaneous miracles. Mm. Somebody just needs to receive that right now. God is going to work a miracle. If he hasn't already mm. done it yet, you can take it to the bank. Because God is going to work a miracle in somebody's life. We touch and agree right now. We're believing. We're praising in advance because mm. we know that it's already done. Ishakato mahaya. Ikapoko tokari. Isoto yikata yet. Oh. Ishato Jesus. There was a. There was a moko hahikasa. Thank you, Jesus. There was a lady that was on the prayer. That was on the live feed. Her name is Heather Fleming, and she wrote. She said, "I need God." She said, I need God, please pray for me. So Heather, I, if you are still listening right now, what I want you to do is mm -hmm. after we pray for you, I want you to contact either myself, you can contact us through the church's page, you can contact us uh, through one of these pastors' page, 
uh, that is on the line right now. And we will get you connected to a pastor that is in your area that will come and minister to you and pray and pray with you. Even after we pray right now, I believe that God's going to do something in your life tonight. But we want to get you connected to a pastor that you are close, that's close in your area. So after we get off of the live stream or even right now, you can go to one of our one of our Facebook pages. Uh, or you can our Facebook church pages, or you can go to one of our personal pages or our wives, uh, and we will get you connected to a pastor. So pastors, if we can lift up Heather, Heather Fleming right now in the name of Jesus, you can unmute your mic pastors, and we're going to lift up Heather Fleming right now in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for right now. We pray in the name of Jesus, God, for Heather Fleming, God. We pray, God, that you would anoint and touch her, God. You know exactly what she needs and where she's at. I pray, God, that you would draw her in, God, with your love, God. That she would so feel it, God. Praying, God. I pray, Lord, that you would touch her, God. I pray, Lord, that you would touch, God, any fear, anything that's within her, God, that is not of you. I pray, God, that you would draw her, God. I pray that you would, God, bring somebody into her life, God. Life. Pray, Lord, that you would touch her and anoint her tonight, God. Direct her, God. I pray that your hand would be on her, God. We plead the blood of Jesus, God, over her mind, over her heart, God. Her, Thank you, Jesus. You God. God, you're able, God. 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 You're able, God. God. You're able, God. God. Pray in the name of Jesus, God. 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 Touch her tonight, God. Touch Heather, God. Touch Heather tonight, God. We lift her up under you. You know what she needs, God. I pray, Lord, right now that she would anoint and live in touch God. Anoint whoever, God, she comes in contact with, God. I pray, Lord, that you would anoint it, God. I pray that she would receive your words, God. If she hasn't been baptized, I pray that you would, God, God, speak. Yes, God. Yes, In the name of Jesus, Lord. And we thank you. We praise you, Lord. And we worship you right now. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. We want to pray for the Clausen family. The Clausen family said backslidden children and husband. And she is asking to be refilled with the Holy Ghost and her grandchildren. So we can pray for the Clawson family right yes, now. Yes, yes. Father, in the name Hallelujah. of Jesus. Hallelujah. We bring the Clawson family unto you, God. We bring them to the throne, God. And we ask that you would anoint them and touch them, God. Name of Jesus, we intercede for that family, God, the whole family. I pray that you would refill them, God. I pray that you would touch them and anoint them, God. I pray, God, that you would lift them up, God, and they would understand and know, God, God, that they cry out to you, God, and you will fill all those that are hungry, that are crying out to you, Lord. Fill them with your spirit, fill them with your joy, fill them with your peace. Jesus name. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I touch them, God. Touch the children, God. Touch the household, God. Anoint them, God. Touch them, God. Touch their hearts, God. Touch their lives, God. I pray, God, that you would hold them together, God, with your presence, with your spirit, God. God. Just go and flow, God, into that home, God. Flow into the situations, God. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Lord, God, we're praying that you would fall on her, God. And that you would right now, God. Wherever she may be, God. God, oh God, let your spirit fall upon her, Holy Spirit. Thank you right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Right now, there's about 100 yes, people that is on the live stream right now. We ask that as we are calling out people's names and we're giving their prayer requests, we ask that you would touch and agree with us in the name of Jesus. 
We have another prayer request. It is for the the Ramey, Amy Rainey. She says her first lady, her first lady, Sister Hill in Pontiac, Illinois. We want to touch and we want to touch and agree with her right now. I don't know what's going on. She didn't type this situation, but she did leave the prayer request for our first lady, Sister Hill, Sister Hill in Pontiac, wow. Illinois. Brother Rima, do you know who she is? Kyle, yeah. Kyle, okay. Mm -hmm. We want to touch and agree right now that God will touch her and God will meet her need, whatever it may be in Jesus' name. Father, right now, Lord God. We Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus. God. Right now, right now, right now, God, you know the situation. Lord, God. Lord, you know God. The situation. we bring it before you right now in Jesus' name that you would anoint her and touch it. God, we lift her up unto you, God, and we pray, Lord, that you would touch her body. God, you would touch the circumstances and situation. We speak health, God. We speak Boldness, God. We speak it right now in Jesus' name. God, we rely and depend upon you, God, but you are able, God, to minister right now as we speak it, God. The authority of the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Dispatch angels, God, around her. I pray in Jesus' name. God, help her, God. Direct her, God. Guide her, God. We give you the glory. We give you the praise for her, God. God, you are almighty. You are all powerful. Hallelujah. You are all seen. You're everything, God. We give you glory. We declare it, God. We speak it, God, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Yes, God. Yes, God. In Jesus' name. Yes, God. I want to pray for Sister Ambulance and her son. He's going through some issues right now. We want to call her son out, Donald, in prayer. I know this family personally. So if we can pray for Donald Ambulance and his wife and his uh, mother, Jackie Ambulance, in Jesus' name. Yes, All right, Father, in the name Lord, of Jesus, we pray right now, God, 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 you would touch the ambulance family, God, that you would touch them, that you would anoint them and touch the God, God, any any situation, God, that they need your divine, God, your divine touch tonight. Lord, boy, the work right now in Jesus' name. Lord, ask God that your hand would be on Hallelujah. Yeah, touch God, that, God. God. Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Touch the situation, touch God. the circumstance, God. God. Hallelujah. You know it, God. And we go before you right now, God. God, and we bring them before you, God. Bring them before your throne tonight, God. Asking God that you would bring them before God, I pray, Lord, that you would bring it. Let them feel your love, God. Let them feel your arms wrap around them, God. God. Proclaim it, God. In Jesus' name. Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, God, we thank you right now. We in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. We want to pray for. We want to pray for. Betty, Betty Alfaro, she said, my children need to return to God. They were raised in church. Their names are Chris, Eric, and Misty. So we want to pray for Chris, Eric, and Misty, that God will restore them and bring them back to the house of the Lord in Jesus' name. All right. Lord, Lord, Father, Lord. in the name of Jesus, Lord, we God, we pray, come God, in your you, glorious God, name, God. I pray, God, for Misty, God. I pray, Lord, that you would bring them back, God, that you would restore them, God. You're in the restoration business, God, and I pray that you would touch their hearts, God. I pray that you would put them, God, in their heart, God, and they would turn to you, and they would repent, God, and be reconnected to your body. I pray in the name of Jesus, fill them with your spirit, God. Fill them with your hope, God. They need you, God. I pray in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Restore unto them, God, the day of their salvation. Restore unto them the Holy Ghost. Restore unto them, God. Bring them back, God. They're part of the harvest, God. Bring them back, God. I pray in Jesus' name, God. I pray, God, that prayer is going forth right now for them, God. I pray, God, that prayer is going forth right now for them, God. I pray, God, that prayer is going forth right now for them, God. I pray, God, that prayer is going forth right now for them, God. I pray, God, that prayer is going forth right now for them, God. I
pray wherever they are, God, that you would touch their hearts, God. You're right. I pray in Jesus' name, God, that they would turn to you. They would turn to you. They would turn to you, God. We pray for them, God. God, with this tonight, God, in Jesus' name. Once again, in the name of Jesus, Lord. And we thank you right now, God. Thank you, Lord. We praise you in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Yes, we, yes, we are. I was just, as I was just praying uh, and asking and seeking the Lord about an individual that he wanted us to pray for next, uh, Brother Eli Hernandez came to my mind. And then my wife had just wrote his name down as a prayer request from my pastor, uh, Brother Hurt. And so I'm asking that everybody that is on this live stream, uh, lift up Brother Eli Hernandez oh, yeah. in your prayers right now. Mm -hmm. uh, some of you know what's going on in this situation, and some of you may not, but we ask that you would lift his name up right now in prayer. I believe that God is going to work a miracle in his life in the name of Jesus. Come on, Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, Lord we pray in the name of lift Jesus. Brother Hernandez up God, right we lift now. up Brother Hernandez Lord, we you, up God, up. I pray, Lord. Uh, we Hallelujah. We dispatch God, angels God, all around him, God, God, that you would touch. This is God, God, touch Brother Hernandez, God. God, I pray, Lord, that you would touch his body, God. Hallelujah, I pray in the name of Jesus, God. Hallelujah, Lord, you are able, God. God. I pray in the name of Jesus, God, that you would touch it, God, that you would anoint that man of God. Hallelujah, that you would touch his body, God. I pray in Jesus' name, God, that God, he would improve and strengthen him, God. I pray for his family, God, that you would anoint and touch his family as well. I pray in Jesus' name, God, be with him, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, anoint it, God. Lift up his family. We lift up Sister Hernandez, God, that you would touch her as well, God. Give her peace, God. God's strength in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. You are in the name of Jesus. 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 In the in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I believe right now we need to pray for our we need to pray for our evangelists and we need to pray for our missionaries right now. I believe that we need to pray for our evangelists and we need to pray for our missionaries. Because right now, you know, this 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 pandemic is affecting them in great in so many different ways not just financially but in other areas and so we need to cover our evangelists and our and our missionaries in prayer right now father in the name of jesus we'll lord right god, god. We'll pray right now, all of our evangelists god missionaries that are out there god that have been disrupted god i pray lord that you are a provider of god god you are able god to touch god and turn around the situation god god to your good i pray in the name of jesus god god that you would anoint them and touch them god i pray for each and every of Evangelist God, I pray God that you would anoint and touch and bless them, God, that you would encourage them, God. I pray in Jesus' name, God, we lift up God. I pray, Lord, that any restrictions, God, on their travel that would not limit their ability to minister in some way, God, through some tool, God, in some way and means, God. I pray in the name of Jesus, open up opportunities, God, open up ways, God. In Jesus' name, God, orchestrate it, God. You are able. God, God, you have a divine order, God, and a purpose, God, and I know your word is going to come forth, God, and you're going to anoint the evangelists, God, anoint the missionaries, God, anoint them and with them, God, I pray, God, that your hand would be on them, Lord, you are mighty, God, you are holy, God, you are everything, oh, Jesus, we give you the glory, we give you the praise for it, God, we lift them up unto you, God, in Jesus' name, thank you, Lord, worship to Jesus, hallelujah, 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 Abacoria Tacay, Yabo Cosoto Babocoria, Yadabaca Sakara Corio Cobo, 
Touch it, God. Touch it, God. I touch it, God. I touch it, God. I touch it, God. I know them, God. Bless them, God. Hallelujah. Let your spirit flow. Let your spirit flow to them, God. I pray in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm praying, God, that you will be pastors, Lord. God, I pray God, that you will give you praise. We give you glory, God. Touch them, God. I touch their families. Touch their children, God. I pray, God, I hedge around them, God, for protection. I pray, God, that you would God, encourage them in the spirit, God. Send people, God, to minister and help, God. God, I pray, Lord, that you would lay it on people's hearts, God, that would sow into their ministries, sow into their lives, God. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Name in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. 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 Name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Hallelujah. Lord, you are mighty. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Great Jesus. Great Thank Jesus. You. You're awesome, awesome Lord. Lord. You're awesome, God. There's a sister Amy, Amy Ramey. She asked, she said, let's pray for Easton. This is pa Pastor Navis's, uh, Navis' grandson from Bloomington, Illinois. Uh, Brother Rima, do you know, do you know who they are? What's his name? Pastor Na Navis. His grandson has eye cancer. Uh, Pastor Nave, yeah. Ba okay, okay. Yeah. His grandson has eye cancer, and so we want to we want to pray um, pray for him, and we want to pray that God will touch his body, touch his eye right now, and remove that cancer in Jesus' name. Brother Rima, can you lead us in this prayer, please. Yes, sir. In the name of Jesus, Lord, Lord God. Jesus, Lord, 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 begin you're a healer. Oh, no, no, I'm not you are a healer. Lord, 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 God. Lord you're able, God. You're able to touch Easton, God. You're able, God, to heal him right now, God. I just the belief in your word and your ability, God. It's not us, it's you. Lord, I pray right now in the name of Jesus. Let it be a miracle that you're able to do, God. And I pray that you would anoint and touch it right now in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, we evoke your name, God, and all the power that goes with that name. And we speak it right now in Jesus' name. You're able. This name, touch it. Touch it, God. Hallelujah. I believe. I believe. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That as you touch it, God. Hallelujah. It is a great testimony, God, of your healing power. God of your authority and your name and your word. I pray in Jesus' name, God, that you would touch it, God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. 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 In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. You're a healer. You're a healer, God. You're a healer, Lord. And I'm all called your come to you from these miracles, Lord. Jesus. Thank you. Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Faith mm. must be converted from these miracles, Lord. God. Mm. Mm. Brother Lord God, flow, God, flow. Brother mm. McKinnis. Mm. Um, there, Sister uh, Denise Steele, she said, pray for all the health workers, including my daughter, Kim, and our children, young people, and, and her grandchildren the nursing home residents, the homeless uh, behind the prison dar the prison bars, uh, the cities that are hit hard. Uh, could you lead this prayer, praying for all the healthcare workers and, the, and her daughters? Um, their names is Kim, uh, Kim and Cherie and her grandchildren. Yes. Jesus. In Jesus' name, also, we lift up Kim and Cherie. Also, 
Lord, we lift up Kim and Sharifi. God, we pray in the name of Jesus that you would anoint and touch them, God, and all the healthcare workers that are out there, God, on the front lines. God. I pray in the name of Jesus that you would go before them, God. Each and every person, God, that, that's going in, God, to harm's way, God, you are a healer, God, and I pray right now in Jesus' name that you would go before them, God, as they minister in their profession, God. I pray that you would be before them, God. I pray, God, that you would protect them, God. Keep them, God, from any diseases. Keep them, God, from any anything that would harm them or touch them, God. I pray that you will go before them, God. That as we pray today, God, that you will go before the niece's children, God, that your hand would be on them, God. God, we lift up all those, God, that are in harm's way, all those that are serving on the front lines, our healthcare workers, God, our firefighters, God, all those that are out there, God, our first responders, God, our police officers, Lord, all those that are serving our communities, God, that are going in and being in contact with people, God. I pray a hedge around them for protection, God. We lift them up to you, God, and I pray in the name of Jesus, God, that you would anoint it and touch God. We need them, God, and I pray that you will protect them, God. I pray that you will protect those civil servants, God, the healthcare workers, God. Hallelujah. The first responders, Lord, anoint them and bless them, God. Uh, we pray, God, in the name of Jesus, we give you glory for it, God. We give you God, all praise for it, Lord. You are a healer, Lord, and you are a provider, God, and you are our Prince of Peace, God, and I pray that you would touch them, God. Touch all those that may be gripped with fear as they go to work. All the healthcare workers that as they travel to work, God, they're going in, uh, touch their minds, touch their families, touch their children, God. In Jesus' name, we give you praise. We give you glory for it, God. Anoint their houses, God. Keep their homes safe. Keep their homes free from any virus. Keep their homes free, God, from any disease. Keep their homes free from any of that, God. I pray that you would anoint their children as well, God. God, that nobody would be a carrier. We would just be carriers of joy and hope and peace, God. I pray in Jesus' name, anoint them and bless them, God. We plead the blood of Jesus over that prayer request and over all the healthcare workers, over all the firefighters, over all the first responders, God, over all the social workers, God, over all those that are working in grocery stores, God, over all those that are working, God, on our day-to-day -day operations that are still essential, God, go before them and protect them, God. We lift them up unto you, God. You're able, God, and you're a willing, God. I pray in Jesus' name. We evoke your name, God, and we stand upon your word, God, God, that you can touch them, God. You can heal them, God, and you can protect them, God. In Jesus' name, we give you glory for it, God. Hallelujah. Thank you. Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Brother, Pastor Ford, Ed Ford, um, there's, a, there's a lady, her name is uh, Betty. She said, please pray for a friend of mine. Her name is Evelina uh, Jardy. Uh, Evelina, she has a prison ministry and he, she has sickle cell anemia, which has taken her eyesight. She needs a miracle. Her name is Evelina and she has sickle cell anemia and it has taken her eyesight and she needs a miracle. Can you pray for her, please, in Jesus' name? Absolutely. Lord, we pray for Sister Evelina in the name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Shekinah. Your servant, Lord Jesus. Shekinah, oh, by your name, Lord God. And she's going to go and we talk to you, Lord God. And you've anointed her, Lord God. God, God, I pray, Lord, that you could, God, give her her sight back, God. I pray that you would anoint her, God. I pray in the name of Jesus, God. We speak it, God, right now. God, we give you the glory for it, God, that you would touch. It, God. I pray in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. Thank you for it, God. We give you praise and honor for it. God, 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 Yes, yes, Jesus yes. Christ, uh, Lord, we lose your restoration in her body. Uh, Lord, new strength, Lord God. Uh, new vision, Lord God. New anointing and new power in the name of Jesus. Thank we you. declare this awesome. and we thank you for it. We believe you for it in Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hallelujah. Brother Duncan. Brother Duncan, there is a lady. Her name is uh, Crystal Anderson. And she is asking for prayer for her mom. She says she has been feeling really weak. Um, and so I see that your mic is, is muted. So if you can unmute your mic and I want you to, to uh, pray, uh, pray, for, pray for 
Crystal Anderson, uh, her mother. She said she has been feeling really weak. And she also asked that we would pray for, uh, pray for Bermuda, pray for Bermuda. It says for a missionary here, for a UPC church here. I believe that it's a country, Bermuda, uh, or a specific area. Uh, so we're going to pray that God will place a burden on somebody's heart. Maybe it's somebody that is here on this live feed, uh, that God would give them a burden to go to this area Amen. and to uh, have revival in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. I come in agreement with that yes, statement God. right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, that you have spoken to our heart, God, tonight. Every island, every part that's going to be world, called. Lord God, that God called uh, to the island, God, that needs to hear the word. Lord, quicken someone on the live right now in the name of Jesus. God speaks, God, the whole God. Hallelujah. Being ministry, Lord God, to that unknown touch of Jesus. I pray, Lord God, hallelujah, for the same mother, Lord God. Hallelujah. I just saw Karieta Kahi. We speak to God right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, the symptoms of Lord God. She would touch the weakness, Lord, begin to slow Yes, God. Slow down, Lord God. Hallelujah. And go away in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Let it touch God. We bring it before you, God, right now in the name of Jesus. Your will, God, God. Your will, God. Your will. Thank you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Nothing shall by any means harm them. So in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We pray against that pestilence, Lord. In the name of Jesus. And we pray, Lord God, that at least, Lord God, at best, Lord God, that is just exhaustion, Lord God. That is causing them, Lord God. Hallelujah. I pray in the name of Jesus. Nothing more, Lord God. Jesus. A quick nap or a good night's rest that will remedy, Lord God, that weakness. Yeah. In the mighty name of Jesus, I give all the glory to you for what you're going to do in that family. In yeah. Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Jesus name. Thank, Thank, you, Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. Uh, Renitha, if you are still on the prayer line, we're going to pray for your pray for uh, Sharon Granger. Uh, pastors, we're going to pray for her together. And we ask that everybody that's still on the prayer that is on this live stream, please pray for Sharon Granger. She is a nurse and has contracted the COVID-19 virus. And so we are believing that God is going to give her a miracle right now. Renita, if you're still on the line, after we pray tonight, I want you to continue to pray for her and I want you to check on her because I believe that God is going to give her a miracle in Jesus' name. Yes, God, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name we bring of Jesus. her before you, God, right now, God. I pray, Lord, that you are a healer, God, and we pray that you're going to touch the body, God, and her body, God. You would touch the virus that is within her, God. It will be a miracle because you are able, God. God, you are our creator, God. You created the body, God. You know the cells, God, and I pray that you would minister to it, God, and you would touch it right now in Jesus' name. Let it be a testimony of, of a prayer, God, that is answered, God. I pray that we would touch your throne, God, and you would touch her body. I I pray, God, in Jesus' name, now that you would touch it and minister to it, God. I pray, God, for healing, God, right now, in Jesus' name, for a miracle, God. We speak it, God. We believe in your word, God, and we stand upon it, God. God, there is no bounds to it, and you're able to touch it, God. God, I pray tonight, God, God, that you would, God, show yourself mighty, God. Let her, God, let her be delivered from it, God, in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, Jesus name, Lord, yes, God. we pray and yes, we're believing God. God's order in Jesus right name. now. In Jesus, in, name. Jesus in Jesus' name, 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 in Jesus' name. I want us to pray for all of our North American mission churches and churches and all of our startup churches, not just apostolic churches of the UPCI, but apostolic churches all around the world that are that are starting churches or that, or that is a few years from a startup that has been heavily impacted by this, by this pandemic. And so we're believing, um, we need to pray and believe God that he's going to supply and that God will supply all of their needs during this season. 
for them to make not just make it through, but for them to thrive in Jesus' name. <laughs> Father, right now, God, we, we pray, Lord God, right God, for our North Jesus American God, missions. For every Lord, North God. American missions, God. 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 Church, God. 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 All the missionaries that are out there, God, that are planting, God, that are sowing into the harvest, God. I pray, Lord, that you would keep them, God. I pray, Lord, that you would, God, God, show them, God. Give them a vision, God, of what you're about to do, God. Let the circumstances the time, God, be an opportunity for them to be God. God, we speak it right now for cities, God. God, I pray, Lord, for revival, God, that would fall out, God, and break out, God, God, in, in, in neighborhoods and cities, God, where these North American missionaries, God, are planted, God. I pray that you would anoint them, that you would bless them, God, that you would keep them, God. You are mighty, God. You are holy, God. God, you touch it, God. Give them, God, that encouragement, God. Bring people around them, God. I pray in the name of Jesus, we give you the glory. We give you the praise for it, God. God, revival is coming, God, all across Across this nation, this Bible is coming all across this nation. God, anoint them, God, encourage them, God. I pray in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, God. God, as the circumstances, God, of this uncertainty in this world, God, let them be lights of hope, God. Hallelujah for their communities, God. I pray in Jesus' name. We give you glory. We give you praise for it, God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's just Hallelujah. worship God one more time. Yes, God. Yes, God. Lord, I praise you. Lord, I worship you. Hallelujah. We give you honor, God. We give you praise, God. Hallelujah. We lift up your name, God. You are high and set apart, God. We stand upon your word, God. I pray, God, that you will continue to, God, to, to operate, God, every word that was spoken, every promise that was declared. God, I pray that you would, God, bring it to pass, God. I pray in Jesus' name. God, for revival. I pray, God, for restoration. I pray, God, hallelujah, God, for a great restoration of the people, God. A great awakening, God, within the body of Christ. A great awakening, God. Hallelujah. Touch it and anoint it. Bless it, God. We give you glory, God. We give you praise. We thank you, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. We want to thank you all for tuning in to this live stream broadcast uh, prayer meeting. And so after we get off and pray, I want you to continue to pray. And one other thing that I want you also to do, and I want you to pray and seek the Lord about this. I want you to pray and seek God for somebody who you can bless financially. It doesn't have to be necessarily a church. It can be a pastor. It can be uh, your neighbor. It can be anybody that God, whoever God puts on your on your mind. I want you to take to ask God to give you a number that you can bless them with. There's a lot of people that have been that have been uh, devastated by this pandemic. Some people's finances and and the way that they that they're living. It has been completely affected by what is going on right now. We don't know how long this thing is going to drag on. And I believe that God is calling us, the people of God, to be a blessing to somebody else. All right. So I want you, if you know a neighbor that is in your neighborhood, somebody that is struggling, maybe there's a family that you know that doesn't have, that doesn't have uh, the finances to be able to buy food. Go, go find somebody and pay for their, pay for their food. Go, go ask somebody if there's something that they have need of. There was a neighbor of mine that was across the street that I asked her, I asked her, I said, do you have everything that you need? And she had made the statement. She said, I think so. She said, but I just don't know. She said, because I don't have, I didn't have the finances to be able to purchase everything, uh, everything. She said, I don't know how long this is going to drag out. And so hopefully that I do have everything. But that was kind of a mental note for me that she might not have everything that she needs. So we're going to check back on in with her. And if she doesn't have or she needs something, we are going to bless her and we're going to buy it for whatever it is. So I want you all to participate in this. And I want you to be a blessing to somebody else. If you feel the need to go and bless a church with an offer, go bless a church with an offer. If you feel the need to go bless a man of, or a woman of God with an offer, go bless a man or a woman of God with an offer. If you feel the need, go, what, pray and seek the Lord about somebody that you can bless. I believe that in this time, this is not the time for us to be greedy and just and to just focus on ourselves. 
I believe that if we seek God to bless somebody else or to give to somebody else, that God will take care of us. If we take care and we seek God to bless somebody else, then God will send it right back to us. We ought to be givers in this season. And so I want you to pray and seek the Lord uh, about somebody that you can give to, some family that you can bless with groceries, somebody who you can buy gas for, or some, whatever it may be. I want you to seek the Lord about this, and I want you to be a blessing because I believe that it's in this season that we need to be a blessing to others, all right? God bless you all. We love you all. We thank you all for tuning in to this live broadcast. Maybe we'll do this again in the future as the Lord sees fit. And so uh, be look on the lookout for maybe something like this in the future, or maybe it may be something that we may physically put on in your area. And so uh, God bless you all. We love you all in Jesus name. Jesus.